Seven Senate over here in Pasadena. This is a really, really good part of Pasadena. Nice house. Nice lot, nice long driveway, two car garage. Nice landscaping. Just two car garage, plenty of parking. Backyard. Nice and square. Neighbors look clean. Enormous backyard, actually, it's huge. Take a little sunroom back here. I believe it is on well and septic. <clears throat> this unit looks really good, about two to three years old. Main entrance. Two car garage. Walk in. Walk into the front door. Baseboard, drywall, trim. You can go upstairs to the left. Walk into the left, bedroom number one. Drywall, trim, baseboard, windows good. 12. 12 by 10 one. Bedroom two on the upper. Drywall, baseboard, windows good. 11 9. 11 9 by 13 1. Bathroom on the upper one. Bedroom three on the upper one. Eleven nine. This room's large. Eleven nine. Eleven nine by twenty three. And this is a, a master. <clears throat> Tile looks good. So it's a 3-2 on the upper. To the main level. Walk straight into the living room. Textured ceil ceilings, drywall, and baseboard. 27-10. 27-10 by 16-10.
brings us into our kitchen. Uh, and our dining room is right behind this wall as well. Formal dining rooms. It says 1111. 11195. Drywall baseboard. And then formal kitchen. 144. 14 4 by 8 9. Does that give you the measurements? Yep. Like yeah. Really? Yep, it's an electronic. See, see the laser? Yeah, this one's like 17 to 22. Yeah, it's a nice yeah, size. How much would a hardwood floor cost in there? Um, I would have to ask my business partner. I'm not sure how much it is a square foot. He, he would know. He actually used to do flooring. Um, hmm. Yeah. They like the hardwood floor around this parquet, you know? Yeah. Of course, it all comes in the individual. It's true. It's true. I think it looks fine. I mean, this is a beautiful, like, first floor right here. Like, take out this wall, open it all up, and then... Yeah, just... everybody wants a wall out. Yeah. Everybody. It's common, right? I, well, I mean, that's... You know, listen, the house is a little bit dated. That's what Will said. Yeah. It's got everything you need, though. I mean, this yeah, is Will, Will said the same thing about the wall. Uh-huh. And then I just put them away. I had these antique, they're like my great aunt hand painted this china, 125 years old. Oh, wow. And this woman came down to look at them. Uh huh. And then she said, Oh, the house is lovely, but that wall has to come down. <laughs> and she's not even here for the house. <laughs> so that, well, the people that looked at the house, they said that, Will said that, and she said that. Mm -hmm. I kind of liked the, the breakup. Yeah. Um, hmm. I guess it, it's, it, it is an opinion thing. Yeah. So it might be more Just traditional. Let me tell you, I've been here for 30 years. I hardly ever use these two rooms. Yeah. When we were members of the Yacht Club, we had a couple of dinner parties here. I had, a, I had a table. It would open up. It would seat 12 people. It went... It was so tight in there when you opened it up, uh -huh. it had a double leaf. Twelve people though, wow. That's a big table. Yeah, it was that. It was a three-piece, the table, the chairs, that, big china clock. I'm getting rid of all this shit. Mm-hmm. You know? Yeah. Well, who knows? We, we might be able to help you out with that as well, too. We, we do have an auction company. So, you do? Yes, yeah, so, so we might be interested Where's in your auction well. company. Where is it? We're located in Glen Burnie, is where we're located. So you do stuff on the side or you buy it? Uh, we, we sell it. So yeah, we, we're not buyers, we, we find the buyers. No. The stuff you sell, do you sell it on consignment or do you buy it and then sell it yourself? Oh, we sell it on consignment. Yeah, we don't, we don't buy it and sell it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yep. What we do. What do you run? Excuse me? What day is the auction run? Um, I would have to check with him. It's 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 mostly a smaller operation with the the things that aren't real estate. So the furniture's out today, right? Yeah. Like this shit here. Uh huh. I mean, this was an expensive set, believe it or not, back in the day. Oh yeah. But you can't give it away. Mm hmm. Yeah, but some some of the other things like that, those those things look look pretty cool. So. They have the original boxes for the Armani's oh, wow. and the certificates. They're all out in the garage. Wow. See, that that, that could be valuable. I've got one big one out there I didn't even bring in. It's called Bird of Paradise. She bought it because it was, she loved this peacock rug. It was a big bird of paradise. Back in the 80s, that thing was three grand. Wow. Oh my gosh. I it's can't about, even imagine. It's about this high. About like that. Uh-huh. The appreciation and then like the... the I don't know if they appreciate it or not. Yeah? Hey, the millennials, you're a millennial. You don't that shit. <laughs> That's for old fuckers. <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh, man. I mean, I, I feel like it, it still has to have value, I'm sure. Well, let me get rid of this shit. Fold this up. These people are coming. So we're, we're downstairs here. And... We have a nice large living room, and we walk out into a sunroom. And this living room is 24-7, 24-7 by 15-7. And we have a half bath. A 
a laundry room. And another office or bedroom if we had a closet. 12 1. 12 1 by 10 0. Alrighty. And then is this a um, utility room in here? That's a basement. Oh, basement. Okay. Now to the basement here. This is a uh, framed out. It is six nine to the framing, and let's see, about thirty long, thirty long, thirty long, thirty, thirty long, twenty seven eight wide. So this we can add a lot of a lot of finished space here. Plenty of room for another bed, bath, living room. Um, well and sump pump here. Also, um looks like they have the uh utility room framed out here. Two hundred amp box. Boiler framed out. Foundation and everything looks solid. Super solid. Maybe they were putting a half bath back here.